welcome to the Hope Center. And we're here to do some interviews uh, with people that are talented, um, that are therapists, or I've got a passion or a dream. And today is our first interview from the Hope Center here in High Wycombe. And I've got Maria, Maria who does the bars method. So what is the bars, Maria? So basically the bars is, um, you have 32 bars in your head, which is made to different areas of your life. So it can be um, control, money, um, awareness, hope and joy. And what I'm doing is literally lightly touching all those points which are on your head, but I know where, obviously I know where the points are. Um, lightly touching all these on your head and it's just like decluttering. So like, say your brain's like a hard drive, so your brain is like, when I'm doing the bars, it decutters and creates more space. So it's re like wiping it all out. So it's just creating more, more space, more, more. I don't know. It's really good for um, it's really good for sleeping. It's really good for um, you know, that negative chatter in your head. Brilliant. So, so, so just to recap on what you said, it's mm -hmm. a bit like a detox. A bit like you when you say you're clearing out. A bit like when the computer, the hard drive mm -hmm. gets too busy yeah and there's too much on it so mm. you you put you have a virus control or something it's more, is it it's more like like it's just creating like it's just wiping or clean all the stuff that you've ever you know ever had about those thoughts and feelings and limitations about money about control about awareness and just like getting rid of it all so you can create small space that's really interesting i have to say i did have a virus method from Maria quite a while ago, mm. and um, things have started to fly for me. I'm not mm. saying I'm not sure whether it was that. I'd like to think mm. that it was part of it. But every as you can see, things are flying for me, and I've now got a center in High Wycombe. I've popped up in here, mm -hmm. and so much seems to have happened because I remember saying to you, "I can't attract money, mm -hmm. and I can't attract success." And two months later, I can't remember, it was maybe the beginning of the year. Yeah. Look where I am. Yeah. So obviously something changes when yeah. you have this. Yeah. So do you want to explain to us a little bit of where does it come from? What's the origin, the origin of the bar? So basically it's um, by a guy called Gary Douglas. He, um, and his, well, it's called Access Consciousness Bars. And there's different other, other different methods, but the main one was bars. And he what he did was he um, basically was asking quality questions. I can't remember the question right off the top of my head. Um, I think it was something like, "What would you know, perceive, and be?" Or something. I, I really can't remember the question. And um, he asked the question out to the universe. And um, a couple of weeks later, he a therapist or hypnotherapist rang him up and asked to be. He wanted a different method or something like that, something around those lines, and he channeled the points on the head. Right. So then he started to like things were. Then he did the bars on other people, and things were just like moving and in moving their in their lives. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it's just a big. It's amazing. I love it. I personally love it. I haven't done it for a while, but I do like doing it. It just just gets gets rid of the negative chatter. Okay, so helps me. Sorry to stop you there. What? Is, why do you like it so much? Because you do have a passion for it. Yeah. So what? What is it about it that you like so much? Personally, for me, when I first did the bars, I saw loads of different like energy and stuff. But the second time I did it, like things just moved. Like um, I got the job I really wanted. I just seemed more clear, more focused. And it just seems like every time if I'm getting so like really stressed, then when I have the bars, it's just like relaxing, getting rid of all the crap, getting rid of all the just the day to day things, and just having like a it's like a breath of fresh air sort of thing. It's just relaxing. So you, when you yeah. actually have the treatment, mm -hmm. do you have a treatment from someone else? Can you do it yourself? You can do it yourself, but I prefer to. Do it. I think it's more better if someone else does it sure. for you. So, do other groups, you know, where therapists can work on each other, or so yeah, you can well, actually get. There is a. Help? I did in the past a meet up group which was based in London, um, and had people who were practitioners or facilitators who do bars, or people who just want to experience for the first time doing exchanges. I've stopped that at the moment, but hopefully in the future I might set it up again. Mm. Um, or if you meet someone in the learn the bars, and you can contact them, and you can swap. 
So I have done it in the past. I have done it for a while, but I will get back on it. Wonderful. Well, you're here at the Hope Centre. Mm -hmm. We've got you here. And when are you coming here to do the bars? I mean, this well probably this program may not get go on this week, but mm -hmm. we as we're coming back in June as well. Mm -hmm. But if it does go on, um, when will you be coming back to do the bars here? Well, this week? hopefully this week on Wednesday, mm -hmm. and any other like maybe Friday. I don't know. It depends. Mm -hmm. on obviously, you guys, right. and I'm I'm available whenever really. Like I'm just setting this, just doing it one to one for a while. Um, just yeah. starting to get the ball running with that, yeah. so hopefully fingers crossed. Okay, do you have a website or a way of people getting in touch with I've you? I've got an email. Okay. Yeah. So do you want to say that or would you rather we pass it on through moving on to... Yeah, do that through moving okay. on to you, yeah. So if you want to get in touch with Maria, you can come to the Hope Centre. Uh, if, as I say, if this does go on before we close this week, if not, you'll probably be here in June. Yeah. Definitely. So we will be providing uh, the bars method here in June. So please keep watching our programs, subscribe to our channel, and also we can tell you more about how Maria is getting on. So, anything else you would like to say about the bars? I mean, are there any particular contraindications, for example, that you plan to work on? What do you mean, sorry? Well, I mean, contraindications in the way, is there any people that, in particular, any conditions to make it more clear? Oh, okay, yeah, it's really, it's really good for um, children who have exams, it's really good for um, children with ADHD, anyone with ADHD, um, it's good for women who are pregnant, it's good for anyone and anybody, people who are, are really have a, you know, you get burned out, you get tired, you get stressed, just day to day, like, from work, whatever, it's really good for anybody and everyone, really. Right. There's no, no, you shouldn't be doing that. You can't. So there's no run. contra. That's why you didn't actually understand when I asked that oh, question. Oh, okay, yeah. Because a lot of therapies, you can't actually use them mm. when women are pregnant or certain conditions. You can't mm. actually use certain therapies. No, it's for everybody. But this is a bit like meditation. Yeah, it's for everybody. Where it's for everyone, and you can only benefit from it. Mm. That's amazing. So um, we look forward to mm -hmm. seeing you in June. Yep. and uh, having you do some treatments here at the Health Centre. Mm -hmm. Is there anything else you'd like to say to all of them? Come and have your bars done. <laughs> <laughs> so come and have your bars done. Yeah. A again, when, when Maria told me about the bars method, mm -hmm. I was trying to figure out what could that mean? You know, because when I think of the word bars, I either think of going to have a drink in a bar mm -hmm. or having a bar, you know, or bar chocolate. So it's really interesting the way you explain it, mm -hmm. as, as we've explained that we have these bars that go through the, the head mm -hmm. or the skull mm -hmm. and it, I presume it's a bit like pressure points or reflexology mm -hmm. where it releases something and then you can start all over again. Mm -hmm. So as you can see life does move on and great things are happening for a lot of us now because of all of these wonderful therapies. So thank you very much, Maria. Thank you. I look forward to you coming and doing some work here thank you. at the Hope Centre. Take you. care. Thank you.